Legend of Total War here, and today we've got a Saving a Disaster Battle playing as the Exiles of Corn, where we've actually got a really good army. It's got mostly Chosen of Corn. There's some um, Soul Grinders of Corn, Exalted Hero of Corn, Blood Reaper, and a uh, Exalted Bloodthirster. Our weakest units are essentially the Mortal Horsemen of Corn, which normally I think are pretty good units, but in this sort of situation here, I just don't have a whole lot of use for it because they get outmatched in pretty much every way. Now, we're going up against dwarfs that. We have higher quality units, but they are vastly outnumbering us. Now, the quality largely lies in all their Iron Drakes. That's quite a problem, especially considering we don't have any missile units to just sort of take them out. Uh, well, we do have these guys here, but they outrange us with their Thunderers. So, Karak here is coming in with one army. Clan Angrand is coming in with two other armies. And we noticed over here with Throny Ironbrow that he has a Master Rune of Spite. So we really need to make sure that our Demon Lords take him out as quickly as possible because it, these guys here could end up getting shredded by him just by passively being in combat. All right, let's jump in here and see what we can do. I think one of the biggest key things that we need to do in this battle here is ensure that their missile units don't shoot us as often as possible. Keep them pinned down. Don't give them any opportunity to shoot. So when it comes down to the Iron Drakes... The best thing to do, I think, is send heroes against them, because they probably won't shoot at the heroes. And if they do shoot at the heroes, it won't do that much damage. Sending the infantry up against them isn't going to be ideal. The, the uh, enemy reinforcements are coming in from the side here rather than behind them. So if I deploy my infantry here, I could prevent all of their missile units from really doing anything. That is where their, um, their Rune of Spike is coming in, though. So why don't I put these two guys here? Their job is going to be to snipe him when he comes in. You come around over here, you'll stand about here and just prevent any clan here, or Karak here and armies, units from coming over and harassing us. Because yeah, while we've got them pinned down, if they come up our rear with the Iron Drakes, that's not going to do well for us at all. We don't have fire resistance. And these ones over here, I can't really do much with the Marauder Horsemen of Corn, so I'm just going to keep them over here and try to draw some of the units away. And it's the same sort of thing with the Soul Grinders of Corn. These are high value units that I just don't think I need over here. But I reckon if we can just get their attention and draw them away from what we're doing here, that'll be worth it and use them later on in the battle. Alright, let's see what we can do. Right, that gyro bomber. Let's try to lure it over here briefly. I would love it if this guy here could take him out before their reinforcement shot. We got 2 minutes 44 and a minute 29. Okay. Alright, try and move quickly. Sort that out. Right, we've also got some summons. First thing we should do with that is take out that fucking cannon. Alright, take this out for us. Good. Let's have a look here. That cannon's done a little bit of damage, but we need to stop that right now. Alright, let's just send him straight in to fight the Iron Drakes. That's what he's here for. Okay, yeah, if these guys here could shoot at it, that'd be great. Come keep, keep chasing after it. Alright, you get back over here. Get ready to fight. Alright, looks like that wasn't enough to take out the cannons. But we've still got plenty of them. Him taking out Iron Drakes is fine. 20 seconds until they're in. Okay, that's that's a shattered unit. Don't worry about the rest of taking that out. Although, oh no, no, just don't worry about it. Let's just focus on winning. Alright. It would be good if this guy here could take out the gyrocopters. Alright. Close in. Close in. Do not let Iron Drake shoot. Don't let it happen. Okay. So I do it over here. He's doing pretty well. Yep, just keep focusing on their... What are they doing? On their Iron Drakes. Okay, there's Throny Iron Brow. That's who we need to get rid of. Okay, we got these guys up here, but I can't really focus too much on that. We need to close in on those quarrelers there. Don't let, don't let them shoot. Right. 
kill quicker over there. Kill quicker over here. You're doing fine, but you're a bit surrounded. Actually, if we can get a bit of a blob going on there, I'll pop down the Blade of Corn. So we get the kills from over here to get him killed over there. Okay, this guy's taking a bit of damage. He'll need a potion of healing. But he's doing a pretty good job taking out Throny. Yeah, these guys here are going after him. But focus on Throny first, because he'll be doing a ton of damage. Plus, he's a support unit. Okay, I need to kill quicker over here. Good, this guy's almost gone. Take a bit of damage there, though. Okay, we need to kill quicker. This guy here, actually, I got a potion healing. Okay, Throny's down. That's good. That's good. Take out those ancestor heroes. Alright, no more Rune of Spite for them for the time being. Actually, could you get up here and get rid of these gyrocopters? They're doing a lot of damage to you. Just fly straight up. Like, right now. Alright, like now. I'm getting there. Oh, come on, dude. It's really not that difficult. Use your fucking wings. Fly up. Kill these shitheads. There you go. Okay, it's all good. Yeah, they're just focusing on him. That's good. Good, 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 good. Okay, this one here is taking a fair bit of damage. I'm going to pull it out to keep his the uh, the integrity of his army together, which I think is important. Okay, get rid of these fucking brimstone guns. No, no, stop that, stop that. That's not good. Stop it. Don't don't be doing that to me. <laughs> stop that. Uh, it shouldn't do too much damage. There's not really that much armor piercing. Yeah, just go over there. Okay, we got it. Here we go. Oh, lovely. Blade of corn coming down. Fuck you. Direct from corn. Uh, he's starting to struggle a little bit, though. He's nearly killed that general, though. No, 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 no. You need to be over here. Wait, you deal with this. We've kind of prevented their reinforcements from coming in because they're blocked. Good. Yeah, this guy did a really good job. I, I think what's going to happen soon is he's going to rout. <laughs> I kind of hope he does. Or else he's going to die. Keep these ones out of it for now. Because I can't quite pull him out. I don't think I'm going to get another one of those. This might help him out a fair bit. Guys over here. So reposition a little bit. Uh, how am I going to pull this guy out? He really needs to rout. Then they'll they'll forget about him. Keep that one out of it. I need to pull more out of here, more into the center. Okay, uh, he, if he broke, they'll let him out of it. So that's okay. I think I think there's another blade of corn in here for us. Yeah, I think that'd be good. Like I said, don't let their missile units shoot. And yeah, our guy's getting out of there. That's good. Still gotta deal with Karak here. Right, so you, yeah, you stay out of it now. Alright, we shouldn't get too much friendly fire from this either, because that is a pretty nice looking blob. Maybe a little bit of friendly fire. Try to pull our guys back just a little bit here. Yeah, a little bit of damage. We smashed him. Plus, we got spell resistance anyway. Uh, we're taking a bit of... Oh, those cannons, we never got rid of them. No, you're, you're done. You're done with this battle. But still, Karak here not participating over here is exactly what I wanted. The fuck do you think you're doing? Kill quicker. For corn. 
There we go. Good. That dude's finally dead. Alright. How dare they shoot at me? I said none of that crap. Yeah, you come over here. Just just watch what's going on here. Revel in the slaughter. Well, okay. The cannons. Oh, no. That's naughty. You don't know how to do that. Luckily, the trees are blocking quite a few of those shots. So that's good, but... You definitely want to put a stop to those cannons. Alright, the cannons are dealt with. Good. So this guy's hanging around. How many kills did he end up getting? Not much. Our guy's here getting loads of kills. That's awesome. That's a really good ability for this area here, because we're in a nice big melee fight. It's affecting a lot of troops. Okay, Clan Angren is just about out. These brimstone guns are coming back. We need to stop them or else they're going to kill our lord. I mean, he's immortal, but you know what I mean. So, no, none of that shit. Yeah, fuck off. <laughs> Come into melee or go away. Nope. Right, we're we're going to have to chase them away. 157 speed to the... No, no, don't worry about it. Alright, we've got another one of these ready to go. Let's do it. Try not to hurt our own troops too much. Nice. We're taking a beating. We were very badly outnumbered. Alright, I think well, let's pop down one of these here. Really just try to speed up the, the kills. These guys here are pissing me off. I know I've got this ability here, but it's really not that useful in this situation. I think. Good for that. Come and destroy one. Nice. Every one of them that gets destroyed. Okay, hang on. We got we got incoming now. Every one of them that gets destroyed reduces their firing rate. Don't really care that much for this ability. Alright, that's Clan Engren out of the way. Perfect timing. So now we can just get them off the battlefield there. And then go wide because we're going to now deal with Karakirin, which we should be in a very good position now. Them fucking around the entire battle. It's just staring at us. That's exactly what we wanted to see. Okay. And our guys here, charge at them. That's it. Maybe you stay back. Ready for another one of these, but we don't have anyone pinned down. Yeah, no, you should not be dealing with. Even going into melee there is not a good idea. Let's keep these iron drakes pinned down while the infantry advance. Alright, you guys should be okay to go into melee now. Yeah, that should be fine. Good, and I don't think it's going to be long before these guys get the army loss penalty. I think we got this. But yeah, you can see how quickly these guys here took damage once they entered the fray, which is why I didn't want them in the fray, for the most part. Stop the Iron Drakes from shooting at the infantry. If they're shooting at single entities, it's fine. But just stop them from shooting at infantry. Okay, 
that guy distracted over there. This guy's coming back, because everyone's pretty much smashed now. Okay. Okay, okay. Goes in. I tell you, just do not let the Iron Drake shoot. Yeah, we want them to end the battle with under a thousand damage each. They're so very good against infantry, even highly armored infantry like Chosen. Oh man, this guy here's nearly destroyed. Get him out. Get him out. Come on, there's nearly one. Come all this way just to have a soul grinder get destroyed? I don't think so. There we go. There's the army losses. Now we just got to get rid of the uh, the slayers. Still gonna end up with a Pyrrhic victory because we did take a lot of damage. There's no two ways about that. Oh, could you kill this dude? For fighting's sake. But I don't think we had a single unit that did a bad job in this battle. Even though these ones here didn't participate really, the enemy still kind of stared at them a little bit. Uh, these guys here, they did a bit of damage and got the Karakun forces to stand still. This guy here did a great job killing Karakun forces. He managed to get 16,000 damage. 200 kills, 149. Everybody got loads of kills. This guy here killed absolutely shitloads. Kills for everyone, except for these ones. Well, they're getting some kills now. High value kills, but low numbers. Since they're the attacker, we should try to make sure we take out as many of them as possible. If you could go into melee with something, you'll regenerate that last little bit of health. That you can. Yeah, do it over here. Yeah, it's still going down. Alright, that'll do. Yep. Expected a Pyrrhic victory from those kind of casualties. But I really think that everything went quite well. And they had some dangerous units that did some damage to us. And that did a fair bit. I really tried hard to get rid of them. It took multiple summons. But none of the units got wiped out, so the integrity of his army maintains, which is really important. Because this is a decent army. But the heroes are immortal, so if it did get wiped out, at least they're still here. And they don't use the warband system, so they can just di directly recruit more Chosen again. It's expensive to do that. Alright, what do you need? You want some favor? Your money's looking... Yes, it's... Yes, that's pretty typical of corn. 4% replenishment's not great. So we'll take the money. Decent size of the map been conquered. Uh, don't don't make me decide on this shit. I don't know what you want. <laughs> uh, shit, I don't know what you want. Um. Look, the game has already been saved. If I just like alt F four out of it now. Um, it won't save again. Oh, wait, wait, hang on, hang on. Is this, is, is this legendary or not? I don't know if it is. Anyway, that's the end of this one here, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something. Appreciate you guys. And don't forget to subscribe. Later, guys.